Welcome back to Narod Masters Academy. And today I'm going to uh, discuss with you guys is SSC Public Examinations May 2022 Mathematics uh, Principles of Valuations. So here you can see that uh, the question paper and mid paper valuation, the marking scheme, and the for which step, how many marks you will get. Some students, what they will think that they wrote complete answer is right, but the final uh, answer which they got is uh, wrong. May they lose full marks or uh, only one or half marks they lose like that they will think. So for that confusion, to, clear, to get that uh, overcome from that confusion, so you just watch this video to uh, how many marks you will get. You can analyze yourself for each and every question. Stepwise marking is given here clearly. For which step, how many marks and uh, look at, just look at here, the first section one, uh, two marks questions each here for group one, first, uh, first question simply, uh, if you expand this one, actually question given is the log of expand log a cube b square and c phi. So c power phi. So if you expand this like this for this one mark, and if you again expand it in the form of logarithm uh, formula, so log a power n formula, n into log a. So if you write in this uh, step, so for this step one mark and for this step one mark, two marks total. So like that, uh, for each question, they uh, divided into the marks. Look at here for finding the value of p of 0, 1 mark and p of 1, 1 mark. So here are the steps given. And here from the uh, progression chapter, so simply identifying a value, d value, and n value for this 1 mark and n formula for this 1 mark and finding the value of a10 for that 1 mark. So some students, what they will do, simply they, they will identify the uh, given data from the question, and but they won't get the correct answer. For the, uh, not getting correct answer, they may lose one mark, but for writing given data, they will get one mark. For expression and simplification. So here, this is from quadratic equation. For expression and simplification, they will give one mark. And for writing this answer, it is not a quadratic expression or quadratic equation. For this sentence, one mark. For plotting the solution points of the equation x plus y is equal to 5 for that one mark and x minus y1 is equal to uh, x minus y is equal to 1 for that one mark. Just plotting this graph. And uh, for the, this is from seventh chapter for, uh, that is coordinate geometry. Simply for writing quite a distance formula, you will get one mark given data. You can say for writing the formula of distance between two points is one mark. For finding the value of distance between two points is one mark. So even sometimes what will happen, they don't know the answer how to find it, but they know the formula. Then they, that kind and that the situation, they will get one mark for this. This is another method. Even if they wrote the formula of this one, then also they will get one mark. For writing tan theta is as a sin theta by cos theta, for this they will get one mark. For writing cos theta as one under root of one minus sin square theta is one mark. So no need to do anything here again. Simply writing tan theta in terms of sin theta. So simply some, uh, substitute in this. For this one mark and for this whole thing, one mark. For finding number of favorable outcomes and number of uh, total outcomes, uh, you will get one mark. So here you can see the steps. For these steps, one mark, and for these steps, one mark. So here question-wise, completely no need to explain, I think, now. So I will scroll down. So all uh, four marks, and eight marks questions, simply observe and then analyze your question paper with your answers.
this is i think uh, from polynomial chapter so very easy question we are given for showing the calculation to find the points of given polynomial is for four marks and the plotting uh, the graph is for four marks so for this you will get four marks now for this graph again you will get four marks for this step p by q form you will get one mark for this step two marks Uh, remaining last step here you will get four marks and for this contradictory writing this one is you will get one mark Here you can see for A union B two marks, A intersection B two marks, A minus B two marks, B minus A two marks. For writing the formula of total surface area of cylinder, one mark. Uh, substituting the value of finding the value of R and H is one four marks. For writing the formula of volume is again one mark. Substituting the values and finding the volume is two marks. And here is the bit paper, the key. Now we will discuss the bio paper as well. and this is the bio paper here you can see that uh, one mark questions section 1 a uh, two mark questions here you can see the note points award marks of uh, to any two relevant answer points so here two points only given but two points you should get uh, two marks Award marks to any two relevant examples. Here, rose is there, hibiscus is there, uh, sugarcane is there, hibiscus, sugarcane, and uh, uh, nerium is there. So, out of these four, if you write any two, then you will get two out of two marks. Materials requires award the marks to any two relevant materials mentioned above. So, no need to write all materials required. If you wrote two out of these all, then you will get two out of two marks. Here also. Award marks for any two relevant points. So here, no need to write all differences for photosynthesis and as well as respiration. So if you wrote uh, two differences, then you will get two out of two marks. Ability to frame questions. So here, so you should uh, create questions. Award marks for any two relevant questions. If you wrote uh, four or five questions uh, out of four or five, if any two relevant questions are there, then you will get two out of two. Analyze first one is L O second one is three to one. So here again, award two marks for the figure. So for drawing uh, you will get two marks, and two marks for labeling any four parts. No need to label all the parts here. If you are uh, if you label to any four parts, then you will get uh, full marks for this diagram. <clears throat> here also award marks for any four relevant points. Here four only given for four points, you will get. Uh, not only these four points, any four relevant points as well. Okay, related to this point, if you wrote any other point, then you will get four point four out of four. Award marks to any four relevant points. Here five points are there out of five. Any four are there means you will get four out of four marks. Again, award to any uh, marks to any four relevant points. Again here, so no need to write all points. So if you wrote any four relevant points to that question. 
will get four out of four. Here for diagram, Hydrilla experiment, this one. Observation. For observation and result, four marks. And for procedure and uh, diagram, you'll get four marks. Award two marks if they draw, draw diagram only. Award marks to any relevant points. So for diagram, they will get two marks. For any relevant points, again, you'll get one mark. So for complete uh, answer is eight marks here. Award four marks for uh, if they draw block uh, diagram only. Award two marks if they write only uh, the names of the stages. If they wrote only stages names, then they will get two marks. For if they draw this uh, block diagram, block diagram, they will get four marks. And again, this whole question is for eight marks. But here, if you wrote this one, again, you'll get two marks for this point. And for the remaining total, six marks. Award four marks for if they draw diagram only. For diagram, four marks. Award two marks if they write only the names of the stages in uh, CADIC cycle. So if you wrote only stages names, then you'll get two marks. Analyze. Award one mark for writing the name of the any two photo, uh, uh, phytohormones. Phytohormones are there here. For each point, two, two marks here. Any two. Award any, uh, two marks for any two relevant answers here. Two functions, two functions. And here is the bit paper. First one is. Uh, Sequences, uh, first answer is A, second C, third D, A, A, D, C, B, B, C, D. So here are the total points and total marks. Okay. I hope you enjoyed this session to analyze your marks and see in the next session. Next video. Thank you.